Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I'll be showing you how to fix Android phone hitting problem. Before we start, hurry up and check out the software just under this video. So let's get started. In this case, you might be having this issue here and on your Android phone here, which in this case, it's really heating up, which is a big problem here. This could actually break your phone in the long run. But in this case, how do we fix this problem here? Well, the first thing that you want to do here is we want to identify if there are any updates on our device. Now, sometimes if there are updates on our device, they or in this case, your device might need that. And there might be some issues with the software itself. That's why it's overheating. So typically, you just need to go to your settings here. And you want to go to the about phone section and if you do see an update button go ahead and click on it just wait for it to complete but once actually completed you should now be able to fix this problem here but uh, if updating your software for your Android phone is not the solution or this does not work for you well there's a, th a few things here they need to do or you need to be aware of so first is you want to make sure that you're using the least amount of uh, apps here. Now, sometimes if you have a lot of apps opened up in the background, this will use some power on your phone, especially if there are going to be a lot of apps and your phone is starting to slow down. Now, what I recommend here is you want to go to your app window. So usually at the bottom left here, you should have a square button there. Let's go and click on it. And if you do see any other apps here that you're not using, make sure to close them. Now, again, like what I said before, if you have a lot of apps running in the background, this could actually contribute to the heat that your phone is generating, which is a big problem later on. But yeah, so that's one of them. So another way for you to close some apps here, because some apps, although you close them, they're still running the background. So what I recommend you try doing here is you want to go to your settings here, scroll down a bit, and you want to go to the section for apps. Now from here, you want to click on manage apps. And from here, you want to go ahead and select all the apps that you might think is actually running in the background. So just to give it an idea, let's go ahead and open up one of our apps here. And usually if the four stop at the bottom left of your screen is light up, go ahead and click on it and basically four stop that app. So in this case, uh, that should solve a bunch of issues here. So this would actually uh, cool your phone a bit here. So if you close a lot of apps. Now, also, another thing that you need to know here is whenever you're charging your phone, especially if you're charging your phone, your phone would tend to heat up. So this is completely normal in some cases. But then again, if it's super hot, then I recommend you to uh, check or in this case, have your phone check or maybe ask for warranty if it's still valid or if the warranty is still valid. But then again, if your phone is getting hot, uh, while charging or in this case uh, if your phone is getting hot while you're using it while charging well in this case stop using your phone now using the phone while charging is not actually recommended this will actually break your phone in the long term so if you're charging your phone just leave it be and yeah so especially if your phone like if it has like fast uh, fast charging so you'll know if your phone has far fast charge if you see a double thunderbolt at the top right of the screen next to your battery now, if you are using fast charging or the fast charging feature here on your phone, or if they have fast charging here, then most likely that is why your phone is actually getting uh, pre or in this case, getting pretty hot. So I would suggest you to stop using your phone. Uh, it won't take like you just need like a few minutes for your phone to uh, get fully charged. Since if you have like, for example, uh, the fast charging feature here, so just leave it for a few minutes. But yeah, so in this case, those are the things that you could do here to probably fix this issue, and that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button, and watch our next video.